What's going on guys? Back at it again with a brand new series here for you guys on the channel. This is on Journey to the Savage Planet Employee of the Month Edition, which is exclusive to the Google Stadia platform. So this game just came out today. This is the day that the game came out on Stadia, which ironically is also the day that Stadia announced that they will no longer be making first party games which is kind of interesting i don't know how i feel about that to be honest uh, actually i do know how i feel about that i don't like it at all i do feel like uh stadia does need exclusives to prosper on the marketplace today especially when you see pl uh, places like you know microsoft and you know sony buying all these uh publishers and developers and etc etc and they're succeeding pretty well and stadia is still you know relatively speaking a niche platform and i hate to say that because i am a supporter of stadia and i would like to see more stadia ga uh, games be exclusive and uh that's how i feel about it but you know google is a very very big company to say the least so who knows maybe they'll just buy exclusives going forward i don't know i hope that's the case because again i really want to see the platform succeed but let me know down in the comments what you guys think about that whole situation and how you guys feel about this game i have been very hyped for this game uh and i've actually been holding out playing this game just so that I can play it on Google Stadia whenever it released and here it is today very excited I know this is a long intro so that's all I really wanted to say I wanted to give in my little two cents on the whole situation so with that being said enough yapping I want to get into this gameplay finally so let's jump right into this What is going on here? Oh, we're waking up. Uh, you know what? This game looks great. My name is Martin Tweed, president and CEO of Kindred Aerospace. Thank you for joining the Pioneer program. Where's the music coming from? Launch, relaunch Javelin? Well, there's nothing in the world I would like more than to launch this craft back to her so you could rejoin your loved ones, should you have any. This remains impossible until you find a suitable fuel source on the planet. Uh, new mission, round trip, view in journal. So let's see, uh, use your scanner to document the planet's ecosystem. Uh, okay, so we got a lot here going on. Global search for fuel source. I'm assuming that's the main objective to the game. Um... Okay. So what are we supposed to do? What is this thing right here? Can I actually activate it? Serve succulent meal? It got stuck. Rude. What do we have here? Use 3D printer. Uh, weapons. I can't, I don't have a weapon. I can't even do anything. I think I'm just too low of a level. Yeah, I think I think we're gonna have to go and actually do something. What's down here? Um, hmm. The game looks pretty great, actually. Oh, what is this? Don't stress, however, as your habitat comes equipped with a 3D printer that is more than capable of turning any old space trash you discover into useful items. <laughs> One minor note. All the fuel in your javelin was used in the journey from Earth and the landing on your planet. You will need to discover a local resource that you can refine into an appropriate fuel. Unless, of course, you decide to spend the rest of your life off Earth. <laughs> but I don't want to take up too much of your time, and I'm sure you're very excited to explore. So I wish you good luck. We will send updates on your progress as you complete your scheduled surveys. Stay alive. And see you soon. Okay, that's the deal. I will stay alive. As long as I possibly can, that is. Kindred Aerospace. Walter 
travel is not for everyone. Side effects of long-term space travel are uncommon, but can include headache, nausea, diarrhea, vomiting, chest pain, varicose veins, bloody stools, feeling emptiness, or hopelessness, osteoarthritis, hemorrhoids, diabetes, forgetfulness, gender confusion, spontaneous dental prolapse, mild discomfort, or death. If you notice any of these symptoms, please contact your kindred representative as soon as possible, and all efforts will be made to help and or rescue you. Note that current rescue time is six months. Oh. Hey. Welcome. My name is Echo, and I'm here to help guide you on your mission. But first things first, please log into the computer and fill out a teeny weeny questionnaire, if you don't mind, so we can make sure you're not crazy. Okay, deal, but where's my computer? Uh, Down here, maybe? No, hold on, this says teleporter, so that's the teleporter. Where's my computer, though? That's the launch the javelin. The computer. Otherwise, I can't open the door. Oh, the right here. Got it. You. I didn't even see this at the first. At first, I mean, I right, a uh, bunch of computer stuff, kindred technologies. A uh, new report. Why is my mouse here? It looks like you made it. Good job. As per your Kindred Employee Experience Program Benefits contact, uh, tract, Contract, uh, you are contractually obligated to submit regular reports during your mission. Let's begin. One of my jobs is to continually assess your mental state, and as space sickness has been an issue for some other recent explorers, could you please identify yourself from this gallery of faces? Uh, <laughs> what? Is this? Let's go with the dog. Thank you. <laughs> I'm super glad you're not crazy. What? Fabulous. Uh, thank you for your time, Explorer. Blah blah blah. Uh, this is the end of the that. That's it. That's the report. Please press the submit button to send your answers to Kindred's data center for processing. Enjoy your adventure and stay alive. Is that really it? And now you're ready to explore. Please walk downstairs and step into the teleporter while I will discombobulate you and then recombine you outside on this glorious new planet. That does not sound safe. Hey, we finally got the grub. Colonizer. Alright, so what am I supposed to do? I'll be taking some more of this. Welcome to ARY-26. It doesn't seem to be, well, a planet at all, really. More that nation of rocks. This mission just got 100% more interesting and about 50% more lethal. Wow. To aid in your exploration, the Javelin is equipped with several small robotic drones that can perform basic scans of the world around you. Please launch them by opening the exterior hatch. Okay, so what am I scanning? Interact with this. Oh, my ship's broken. <laughs> hey, he fixed it. Why did he just sound like a dog? Is because I made him a dog? Is that or I don't know? I'm confused. Great. Am I a dog? Provide you with approximate locations of resources and important info. The javelin is pretty banged up, but you'll need to scan the exterior to confirm the level of. Do that now. Okay, so don't forget to continually <clears throat> scan your surroundings. The camera will transmit data back to Kindred HQ, which will send you blueprints for stuff. Then you can collect stuff to make the <laughs> stuff in the blueprints, and that stuff will help you survive against the stuff you took pictures of. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Uh cartographer development hatch. The Cartographers call this hatch home or would if they were sentient. Okay, so then we got this right here. Some wires. Fuel tanks are intact, but empty. If you can find a local fuel source, you'll be able to get back home. If you can't, congratulations, you're home already. <laughs> this is this is stupid, man. Uh torn fuel line. I thought she said it was intact. Uh, torn fuel line. It's leaking fuel. That's not good. At least you plan to go back home someday. Okay, so I can't sprint with my thing on. My scanning thing on. Uh, this exterior panel must have been knocked loose on landing. I am adding a location marker to your compass. Please find it and scan it. 
If you lose your way, you can always hit the survey button to highlight its location again. Okay. Uh, Pierce Tall. There used to be something covering this, I think. <laughs> Ridiculous. Alright, let's check the other side. Okay, so we got a couple things we gotta scan over here. So, what is this big thing? That's not supposed to look like that. You don't say. That's all you gotta say about it? Busted landing gear. Not the smoothest landing, but at least we survived, right? Then there's this thing. This is the teleporter. This machine will copy you into its memory. Delete your body and then print a copy of it five feet away. What? <laughs> the javelin teleportation field. The javelin's teleportation unit. Oh, it said, and it had a teleportation in quotations. Uh, bait dispenser. Uh, dispenses unlimited bait. Become the master of bait. I'm... Oh my god, dude. The master baiter. Oh. Okay, then. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That's pretty hilarious. Hey. We found a part. Ah. Uh, there is our missing panel. Well done. In the future, whenever you need help finding your currently selected objective, you can use survey to orient yourself. The job awesome. is basically intact, but in need of minor repairs. If we ever want to relaunch. Yeah, one day. Oh, the photographers found an alien alloy we could maybe use to repair the ship. Let me mark it. Uh, fixer upper. Let's see what this says. No, that's not what I want. Fixer upper. Find a way out of the ice caves. Okay, the cartographers have found the alloy I need to initiate the automated repairs uh, of the javelin. But first, I will need to find a path out of these caves. I bet you it's this way. Dude, I'm a dog. Is that because I chose the dog character? I am detecting a fortuitously fragile surface nearby. Please scan to confirm. Uh, these things? These crystals look extremely breakable. You could take out some unexamined aggression on them. So, looks like you will need a new tool in order to venture further. I have added a new blueprint to the Javelin's 3D printer that should do the trick. But in order to print it, you'll need to gather some basic resources from the local fauna. Okay, sounds like a deal. Ooh, what are these things? Let's scan. Puffer bird. What is that thing? There's so Fair many drugs, things. But good drugs. For healing. <laughs> For healing, not fun. Kids, don't do drugs, alright? Oh my god, they're freaking adorable. Look at their eyes. Did they just poop? Can I? This is bait, right? So can I? How do I use this? Pre. I could slap him. <laughs> okay, so I think I need to do something with this. How do I use it though? Oh, there we go. Do I have to? Do I have to slap them then? Hey, oh my god, I blew him up. You picked up some carbon. He Get slimed me. <laughs> nice work. You have collected enough carbon to craft a basic nomad plasma pistol. Ooh. The 3D printer inside the javelin is ready for your input. Ooh, yes. I want. I want a pistol. Okay, so I can't get out of there? Can I scan this? These aren't real. Oh, okay. They're called tenoreeds. Not tenoreeds. Tenoree. Oh, tenoreeds. They're tenoreeds. Big difference. Yep. Huge difference. Huge. Like, I don't understand how people get confused between tenoreeds and tenoreeds. Yo, I'm a dog. Is that because I chose a dog? I don't know. So if I would have chose a guy with a mullet, would I be like a mullet guy from the 80s? I don't know. Very interesting. Every time you 
when you return to the javelin, you automatically deposit any resources you were carrying. Cool. Anything you drop outside the javelin, however, will stay there until you go and grab it with your meat hands. <laughs> All right, so she said... Hold on, I want to hear that. It's a perfect time to hit the park and kick the bag around. But one can get frustrated when your natural legs only bend in the middle and only bend so far. What if you could maximize your flexibility of performance to take your game to the next level? <laughs> now you can with Flexlivia. Oh my Flexlivia god. Flexlivia is a topical salve you apply to your appendages, and in just four to six weeks, you'll begin to notice a drastic improvement in your flexibility up to 9,000%. 9,000, eh? results are remarkable. <laughs> Flexlivia should not be taken concurrently with Tostenda BT or any extreme oh extender, which can, in extreme cases, lead to Waffles Crazy Legs Syndrome. Side effects can include completely normal behavior, dry mouth, moist mouth, itching, redness, burning, dizziness, oh my nausea, God. bladder blabber, reverse buck teeth, looping face palm, radioactive toenails, strawberry licorice lips, mild to severe <laughs> farts, uncontrollable crunking or clowning, frequent thoughts of taking it easy, sudden hairy back, baldness disorder, Ew. long annoying lists, impromptu bongo playing, dog bites, then temporary or permanent death. See website for details. A side effect is dog bites? The game has changed. And for the bendier, it's time to level up your flex. With flex linear. Oh my god, dude, this is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Alright, so. Uh, weapons. Yes, there we go. A basic plasma pistol. Shoot straight and arrive alive. Hold L2 to aim, uh, R2 to fire, press Y to reload. Yay, I got a pistol! Now you've got a weapon. The single most important tool for any colonizer. Okay. The Nomad Pistol. Sick, dude. I kind of want to... Wait, where's my gun? Okay, so I probably can't take it out here. So now that I have my Plasma Pistol, I'm assuming I could shoot down those crystal things. Let's check. Bam, dude. Does this give me resources? I don't know. Do I have unlimited ammo? Uh, yeah, I do actually. Yeah, this is cool. Give me everything. I'm pretty sure I'm not gaining anything out of it. That looks like there might have been something in there. Dude, I'm definitely a dog. Hiya! Oh, dude, we're finally going into the world. Not before I blast everything, though. All these crystals must get eradicated. I think there's something up here, though. Uh, yeah, dude, there's definitely something. Okay, so I'm probably gonna need an upgrade at some point. Because I can't go up there yet. Probably like a double jump or something, I don't know. Wow, that looks cool. Wow. Man, I like this a lot, actually. Hey, journey to the savage planet. I like that. It may sound weird, but do you see a large tower looming above you? I only ask because my system appears to be functioning correctly, but our initial scan said there should be no sign of intelligent life here at all, and that appears to directly contradict this idea. I will contact your superiors immediately. One moment, please. We literally just killed puffer birds. What does that do? What is what does that do? Should we just shoot it? Is it did I destroy it? No. Looks like it's gonna pop. Might want to get back. Is it gonna pop? 
I have received an urgent message regarding the tower from our president and CEO, which is available for your viewing pleasure at the habitat. Please return as soon as you have a moment. So I'll go back. Man, I want to explore though. See, like, what's that? Okay, we're going to come back. But right now, the computer wants us to go back. Or our little AI companion or whatever you want to call him. Or her. Wants us to go back and check something. So I'm going to go back. Find out what she wants. It better be good. Because I'm in explore mode already. I want to go check out what what's going on. Dude, this is a beautiful little cavern. It kind of reminds me of Superman's, uh, what is it called? The, like his home, the, crap, I can't even remember, the, I don't know, it's some ridiculous name. The solstice? Something of solstice? I don't, I don't remember. Okay, is this the message? Hi. Thing working? Sorry, nope. Buddy. Hey. Hey, yeah, you. Hi. I apologize for the one-sided nature of this message, but, you know, communication across vast distances makes it impossible to do anything else. Makes sense. So, I hear you've arrived on ARY26, and I've uh, I've seen some of the preliminary data, and I have to tell you we have a few questions. <laughs> well, as you know, every planet we initially surveyed showed uh, no sign of intelligent life. The only thing is, your planet is, uh... Whoa. <laughs> wrong. Not wrong. Strange. Unusual. Um, I... We... We need to know what's inside that structure. Okay. Uh, how did our scanners miss it? Who built it? I need you to dig up everything you can. We are searching for a new home for humanity. After all. Why does he sound so evil? I need you to transmit this data directly to me. Yep. Okay. He seems pretty evil. Transfer protocols. This needs to be our little secret for now. <laughs> that smile though. What is this? Remember the good old days? Well now you can live them again at Boomerdale. Boomerdale? Oh my god. Central New Florida, located on beautiful DLC One. Our ancient residents have access to a number of premium amenities like emotional support vegetables, cheese and pizza stations, and much, 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 much. Oh my god, dude, this is so ridiculous. Oh my god. And your remaining biomass is recycled into sustenance for others. Ew! Gross! The freedom of the past, the old fashioned way at Boomerdale. I want to visit Boomerdale. Two hundred and fifty five. Can you imagine living two hundred and fifty five years? That is ridiculous. All right, so now we go back. Temperature 92 degrees. Bio signs nominal. Well, thank you. Got to make sure I'm fully upgraded. Wait, I picked something up. Glacius. Can I, is there a way to check that? Uh, items. No. Kendricks? Uh, no, nah, I mean, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is. I'm halfway tempted to sh to shoot it or throw it and find out what it is, though. Yo, dude, I'm definitely a dog. <laughs> Why is he moaning and groaning like a dog? But I look like human in a spacesuit. Oh, wait a minute. This thing looks like one of these. Oh. Oops. Can I touch it? Oh. Oh, that was cool. Hold on. Let me scan this. These unhatched alien eggs 
can be used like a natural trampoline. I noticed. Yes. Effective? <laughs> you bet. All right, what is this thing? This fungazoid sports several spongy, porous pom pom pons. A wildly branching row. Okay. Can I shoot this? No. All right. Dude, there's literally things everywhere. There's so much to scan, it's ridiculous. Oh, is this where I got the thing from? Now that's metal. Now that's metal? I think that's where I got it from. Test! Wait, how do I throw this again? That there we go. You picked up was yeah. Disgusting and squishy and bouncy. There's so much to do. Alright, I wanna go. Where's that? Oh, there it is. I wanna see what's in here. Wait, how do I crouch again? Oh, there we go. Whoa! Pick up? Carbon. Aluminum. Bombs. The seeds you just picked up probably belong to some indigenous plant from around here. I wonder what they grow on. What is what is this one called? Can I see? Is there's got to be a way, right? Wait, there's two worlds here. Okay, that's a journal, gear, visor, backpack. I'm general. No, all right. So I don't really have much of anything, really. All right, let's go back with this. Yeah, I don't see anything. Are these the different kinds of species? No, yeah, there's, these are all the same guys that I've already scanned before. So let's move on and see if we can potentially go somewhere else. How do I get up there? I don't know. There's so much to do. Ooh, what's that thing? Are any of these guys different at all? I don't think so. I'm detecting a nearby organic compound which may be useful on our exploration efforts. Please scan it. Will do. Hmm. I believe that when mixing that orange substance with your it's an oxygen egg. supply may allow me to tweak its impact on your biology, which would in turn allow you to be more attuned to the local climate. Long-term impacts are unknown, but ingestion is, of course, completely your decision. I'm going to go on a limb and say, and say I have to eat the egg. Please remain calm. I am monitoring hey. your physical response. All is as predicted. I got a level up. adjusting your health and biofeedback to reflect your improved suitability to the chemical mix. I salute your continued embrace of adventure. So I think those things... I have to get those things throughout the game, right? Because that's not... Speaking of which, there's one right there. I'm assuming that that's the way to get level up. Give it to me. Oh, oh, oh. What is the sound? Are these good guys? It's red. No, they're bad. Oh, God, they're bad. Ah, where'd you come from? Get out of here, buddy. Let me go get these things. You. God. There we go. I literally just shot extra. Can I go back up there? Ooh. More materials. Hey, look. There's another one. Damn, they're really everywhere, aren't they? I'm getting all kinds of stuff. That was carbon. Another level up, baby. Oh, no, wait. I didn't level up that time. I'm happy that I, at least I didn't get hit by any of those flying things. How can I... Oh, never mind. I was going to say, how do I get up there? But I could just go around. I hear some bad things. Hey, that gave me another health bar. Level up. Good news, bad news. Good news is those things you ate made you way harder to kill. 
Bad news is you're hard to kill because most of your bones have been placed with rock hard space tumors. Well, that's Please. nice. Potential partners dig tumors. Or so I hear. The Verdant Wild of Zill. I'm willing to bet there's a ton of things to scan here. This anthill is way bigger than the ones on Earth. But the ants are the same size. The same size? Well, I don't know. That is not the same size. What in the hell? She is on drugs. What is that? It thinks you're gonna kill it. Babushka? Oh, how accurate. <laughs> Come here. Dumb, panicky, utterly hum harmless. I want to shoot it. Is there a second kind? I want to kill this thing. What? <laughs> what was that? Can I not kill him? Where'd he go? <laughs> what is going on, bro? That is so crazy. What is this thing? Oh, I am not. Ju I am not doing that. I'm almost certain I need a like a double jump. Yeah, I'm not going over there. So can I not go this way then? Oh wait, never mind. I don't need a double jump. I could just come over here in this direction. Well, since I know now that these things are not friendly. Might as well off him now. Ah! Where'd he go? Got him. I can't get those resources though, unfortunately. There's bound to be something around here somewhere. I say like the most obvious things, don't I? I bet you if I play the game, things are gonna happen. How do I get that one, though? Can I climb on top of these things? Huh. Oh! Whoa, dude, I literally juked them last second. Yeah, I definitely just shot just so I could reload. Ooh, more resources. Give it to me. I slapped him for the for the resources. Got him. Got some silicone. What is this thing? Towering crystals of madness? I don't get it. This planet was supposed to be devoid of intelligent life, but these structures. Why don't you scan this one? Yes, ma'am. Looks like some sort of transport device. If you turn it back on, we can kill you here and make a clone of you at another one you've activated. Or, sorry, I'm supposed to say teleport. Alright, activate teleport. Before you jump in, Kindred says I need to read you a 400 page waiver absolving him of all responsibility. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that was pretty ridiculously fast. So can I, wait, I can teleport now? I can. So javelin, I can teleport inside the javelin, outside the javelin, here, and then I have four more locations. That means this game really isn't that big, is it? Kind of leads me to, to wonder what is there in this game game like what's the the main objective is it just to find fuel so we could leave I don't know I have so many questions not enough answers <clears throat> what's over here have I scanned this nope these are like low shrubs but lazier hey how exciting even more exciting is the fact that the cartographers have detected a trap fluid which could be used to synthesize the fuel for basic jump pack. Please use all possible methods to investigate. Let's let's investigate, I guess. 
I'm very curious, actually. What is in here? Why is it red? Dude, this is gorgeous. Ooh, new, new, uh, no, wait, that's the same thing, isn't it? Why does it look a little bit different, though? Oh, it's, it's a cave version. Sniffle. Is it sick? That sounds very weird. They're cute and full of juice. I'm gonna slap that. <laughs> oh, this game is awesome. Wait, hold on. Is this a different kind? Glowy, but maybe useful too. Grab. Hey, it's a flashlight. That's a flashlight. Can I shoot through these? Ooh, I can. And I can shoot to get the resources off the rocks too. I feel like I'm gonna shoot a lot more. What was that? Hello? Anybody there? I'm a little scared. This place is too dark. I've scanned this, right? Yes. No, I want my flashlight back. Uh-oh. No more flashlight for me, I guess. Hold on. Oh, I can just do this. Oh, this is a different kind of flashlight. It's still a flashlight, but it looks different. Did I already find another? How do I get up there? Hmm. I guess I haven't scanned these. Birds may not look it, but they're salty as hell. <laughs> well, okay then. I want to activate that shrine. How do I get to it though? I guess, I guess I, if I would have just held off from saying that just for like 10 more seconds or 10 more seconds yeah I would have probably figured that out Ex extract and analyze that is this good work now you have the required resources to print a brand new hey. jump pack at the habitat jump thrusters well, It's guaranteed to be amusing. <laughs> oh my god, dude. This game is ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna need this. It's too dark for my liking. Hello? This cave is legitimately terrifying. Only because it's dark. And I don't like dark. I'm not scared of the dark. But, uh, I'm scared of the boogeyman that comes out of the dark. No, I'm just kidding. No, I'm not scared of the dark, but dark, it's easier to be creeped out and scared in the dark. Where's that one shrine? It was on this direction, right? Yeah, there it is. So we can fast travel now. And now we have the thruster, so now we should be able to, like, double jump or something. Use teleporter, so let's go inside the javelin you can craft an upgrade if you wanna yes I wanna uh item no gear no there it is jump thrusters gain an extra boost while airborne press a while midair to jump press B while moving back or sideways to dot ooh Nice. You have upgraded your jetpack. While not capable of full flight yet, it should still allow you to access previously unreachable locations with only minimal release of atmospheric pollutants. She said, not capable of flight yet. So I'm assuming I'm going to be able to fly later. And that would be cool. What is this? Trillions? Ew. 
The 100% artificial food replacement shell taking Earth by storm. Don't be a snob. Eat with the mob. Replace your food with Grom. That's so disgusting. Metaphorical food paste? That's gr that's pretty gross, actually. You know what? Let's go. Where did I see the jump? I think it was right outside, actually. Where we had the double jump. Temperature 92 degrees. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Uh, yeah, that's where the puffer birds were. So let's go this way. Because there's an area where... Literally... Right here at the start where I can... Use double jump. At least I think so. And then I was going to left. And ready, let's go. Perfect. What could be over here? This is this is exciting. Wait a minute, this just goes back to my ship. Does that go back down into that one little cave? Honestly, I think so. But hey, you know what? We got one of these. And I am happy. Not a level up? Man, rude. Man, this game is pretty cool looking, man. I like the aesthetic behind this. Hey, little guy, what are you doing up here? Have I scanned you before? Yes. So, you are getting gooed up. Okay, I, I need to explore. I have to explore. There's so much going on. I love it. What is that thing? That's interesting. Wait, I should be able to go up here too. So I could go up there or up here. Obviously this side looks more enticing to me. But I'm going to go this way. Just in case. Ah! Ah! Can I destroy it? Yes, I can. Away with you. Man, I really need a bigger magazine. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm on drugs. Okay, that, that scared me a little. Can I scan this? No. So I'm gonna blast this from here. I'm not trying to get blasted by that again. Come on, babe. Perfect. The good thing is that it didn't really hurt me. Hold on, my mission... Wait, what's my mission? Because my mission is telling me to go backwards, right? Oh, I can craft... an advanced battery. Finding the local fauna too tough? Add some punch to your shots with this upgrade. Improve damage. You know what? That could come in handy. Insufficient funds, so I need some... A lot of stuff, actually. Uh, supercharger pistol for a single extra damage shot. Man. And then I can craft... So this is the... Because I can't craft this, right? So the only thing I can craft is this. Advanced battery. Increases the number... Increases the battery capacity of your pistol. Shoot more, reload less. I have to. I have to. I was just complaining just now about how this thing... I wish that the magazine could be a little bit bigger. And it turns out I can upgrade my pistol for it. And I'm, it's gonna happen. I need it. You know, for being a dog, I get tired really easily. Does upgrading your pistol upgrade the aesthetic, like the actual aesthetic of your pistol? I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm legitimately interested. 
You can craft an upgrade if you wanna. Uh, yes, I wanna. Alright, I'm not looking up that, uh, the what's it called anymore, the uh, ads. Yeah, that's literally all we could do. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Type of appendages, and in just four short fly chips, your new best friend will emerge. Ready to oh my god, that's disturbing. Meat Buddy, the snuggly playmate from Slimo. What is Aaron Rodgers doing there? Alrighty then. So, okay, let's go back outside the javelin. Because I, I want to, I still have a you lot to explore. In this immediate area. Now that we have the double jump, we literally... Oh, it went from 8 to 10, so it's not super... Uh, like, it's not that much better, but it is... It is better. And I'm not gonna complain for having two extra rounds, you know? And it wasn't that hard to upgrade to this point either, so... Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna complain, but... I mean, it's just two rounds. Let me see here. Can I jump from here? No. And I... Okay, so I, I think I need something else. I want to know what this thing is, though. What is this thing? Looks to be a plant that's grapple. anchored itself to the environment. If you have a grapple, this is where you'd fire it. I'm working on a blueprint for you now. Alright, yes, please. But the grapple, isn't this thing like the grapple seed? Because look, it says grapple seed. So do, if I throw this, does it turn into that? I don't want to, I don't want to test it yet. But I'm pretty sure if I throw that, it'll basically turn into a grapple thing. So I need a grapple gun. Where haven't I been to? I think I've been everywhere at this point. Hold on. I think I could probably explore up there. Maybe. Nah. I'm... Oh god, they're back. What are you doing, bro? Hiya! Sick. Did this one not drop anything? Okay, there we go. I was like nervous. I'm like, wait a minute. Where's my stuff? I want my resources. This game is honestly gorgeous, dude. It really is. In a weird, corky type of way. Hide in the tall grass. Oh, what is that? Oh, God. I thought I jumped off. Okay, I don't... I don't think I could go there yet. There's so much I need to do. Get away! Ah! I'm scared! Oh god. It literally almost got me. There's something behind me, isn't there? Wait, what is it? Oh, you! I didn't mean to throw that. It's okay, what I need to do is this though. Give me some. Wait, what? Why do they look like cheese puffs? Like the Cheetos cheese puffs? Those things are pretty good actually. Oh hey, give me that stuff. That thing tried to hide from me. Is this death? It's definitely death. What are those things? Oh my god, dude, there's literally things to do around every corner. Is that a tomato? I don't know. Let's go. Kane's Icy Refuge. What is in here? Is Did I already scan that before? I did, but he's trapped. Let's free- wait a minute. 
I want. Hey! Okay, nice. So, even more good news. Those tumors that improved your stamina and replaced your bones, they've spread to the musculature of your lower body, which gives you rock hard glutes. <laughs> I am super psyched. Do these give me something else? I don't think so. Dude, they're adorable, man. Those eyes are so adorable. Ha! Alrighty then. They're all dead. I have to go way over there, but you know what, dude? I'm still... I'm still... I'm still searching. I am still searching. I don't know what I'm searching for, but I'm searching, alright? Is that it? There's something right there. Except I want to see what's over here first. Only because I think... This might go back to those puffer birds. Yeah. But it also goes that way. Man, which way do I want to go? Let's shoot down this other side and find out what's on the other side of that before we lock in the direction we're going to first. So this is just that. I'm actually kind of glad that I came this way first. There's so many different places to go, man. It's so crazy. Hiya! Oh, cool. Did we find? What is this thing? Is this a puzzle? Yeah, we gotta. We have to do something. I think. Alright, the question is, where and why? Okay, well, there's a cave that I saw. There it is. Hiya! Is this a button? Let me try scanning it. Uh, did that do something? Hey, hey, this one turned blue. Okay, so I was supposed to scan it. There's one way up there. Can I scan it from way up here? That would be epic if I could. Well, I almost overshot that. Well, that's how I definitely should have used the double jump. Wait, can I scan this thing? Looks important. You should break it. Can I break it? I don't think I can break it. Let's go. Can I scan from here? Oh man, I fell. Uh, huh, that's interesting. So maybe, what does this do? Oh yeah, those are the the jumping things, right? Actually, I think the game's trying to tell me something. Whoops. Bingo. Let's go. Hey, there's another one. Did I just see something? Probably not. So now I have two. The big question is, how do I get to the top thing? Okay, so there's that. Wait, I'm trying to think, where was it? It was up there. All right. Hmm. What if... 
Three. What if? Whoa, that was an accident. Oh my god, dude, I'm so happy that worked. Can I make it there? Actually, I know what I'm supposed to do. Wait. My bad. So first things first. Let's take some more. I want that stuff, so it's definitely gonna happen. Bingo. Oh, dude, I really thought I overshot that. Look at that, that's a lot of silicone. Alright, let's take some more. Okay. I think we found everything, right? The question is, what does this do? Oh, wait. Amazing. You found a different nugget of the alloy we've been searching for. This should still allow me to perform the necessary repairs, and I salute your proclivity for self-direction. So that's what I'm looking for? Is that... That's the fuel? That was a fun little puzzle. Uh-oh. So then let's uh head on out of here. Out of this beautiful little cave we just explored and got some alloy out of. Not gonna lie, when I read that, I read Aloy from like Horizon Zero Dawn for some reason. I don't know. That game's fantastic if you haven't played it yet. Hold on. Purple? What is that? Purple... A higher calling? Oh, uh, journal. I'm looking for journal. Uh, locate and extract the required sample. Bring an alien to begin repairs. Alright, so... Okay, I think it, it, it fixed itself. Whatever it was. I do want to check this, though. Is that damage? Oh god, it is damage. Run! Oh man. Oh god, that really hurt. I want this though. I'm so glad I explored over here though. Give me that. Run! Okay, I need to find... One of those little healing trees. Because I'm down to two health squares or whatever you want to call them. I think that's one right over there. So we need to go back to the ship though so we can begin repairs. Bingo. Now we're back to full. Oh yeah, we're not going that way. What is that? Get away from me, bro. What do you think you're doing? Huh? I don't appreciate it, alright? There's a lot of mayhem, bro. Also, okay, there we go. I will say, also, I don't know how to get home, but I just figured it out. Uh, so home. That's where I fell down, right? Oh my god, so I want to jump this, now that I have the double jump. Let's go! Hey, how do I open this? How do I open that? I'm interested. Do we have access to like a bomb or something? I don't know. It's probably one of those things where I have to come back later for. So for now, let's go ahead and make our way back to the javelin. You! Oh god. I'm so bad at this. Ah! Oh snap! Got him. Wow. That one was juicy. Bonus loot. 
Very nice. You can never get mad at bonus loot. So the javelin is literally right there. I wonder if I'm going to be able to craft anything new. Wait, am I going the right way? I don't know. What am I missing? Or is it this way? I'm confused. Okay, I think I think we're on the right track. Oh, there's another one way over there. But for now, we're going to go say hello to the javelin so we can start fixing her up once and for all. This game is honestly really, really cool. I'm having such a good time with this man. Man, how... Why... We are... I can't believe we landed that badly. Do I have to go inside the javelin to make the repairs? You can craft an upgrade if you wanna. I do. I wanna always upgrade. Sounds like some anime. Totally not garbage. <laughs> Hey! This Better still, this particular alloy seems to be capable of crafting many different upgrades. I have unlocked several new blueprints in your 3D printer. It's like Christmas over here. So what was that thing that we needed? The uh, grapple gun, I think? Uh, fast reload. Uh, so we could get this. Or this. Items. What is this? Better utility. I can't even get this anyways. A higher calling required. So that's the quest. Oh my god. Oh, I already have that. Smart. Smarter visor upgrades your scanner to have a bigger detection range. Also increases your zoom distance and improves survey range. So that could come in handy, but... A uh, general? I don't know. So what do I want? Do I want more damage or do I want a charged shot? So I can't shoot to save my life. So I think this, although it's probably going to be very good, it's probably not going to be good for me because I can't shoot worth a damn with, my, with, a, with a controller. If it was on mouse and keyboard, that would be a different story and I'd do have a mouse and keyboard and I do have access to that but I kind of want to play with the Stadia controller so I'm just going to go with improved damage. I think that's going to be the best bet for me. For now. Upgrade complete. Nice. So we're golden then. Let's get on out of here. Now that we fixed it. Um, let's go to Towering Crystals. 